Hey there, all my fellow barbecue enthusiasts. Mike Baker here, Baker's Barbecue. Hey, today I'm just going to do a short tutorial on my little barbecue dolly here. I guess it's what you would call it. Uh, the table here that I use in all my videos and anytime I'm cooking. Uh, it's really, really handy, really helpful. And I just want to kind of show you today what it is, kind of show you how I use it, and uh, just give you a look on it and uh, see if you got any questions. So sit back and relax, and let's get to smoking. I've had a lot of people ask me about uh, my little workbench here. As you can see, I got my smoker set up. I got this little little workbench here. Basically moving around, so forth. And I've just had a, a lot of people ask me about that. You know, what is that? How does it set up and so forth? So I just wanted to show you a little bit about today. Uh, basically what this is, this is a tool chest uh, base, if you would, on wheels. So normally what would happen is, your tool chest would sit right up in there. And then you would have it stacked up and you could move it around your shop, etc. But what I did, and actually this was a gift from my mother-in-law, perfect gift. I uh, just took it, used it for a barbecue, uh, barbecue table, if you will. So what I've got done here, at the bottom I keep all my wood. There's a big bag of hickory. I got all kinds of wood down there. I got every blend you can have, wood chunks and wood chips. Uh, here I got a bunch of extra wood chips here on top. Here is where I keep my chopping block. And then down inside that, take this over there. As you can see, then down inside that, excuse me, it's a little bit messy. But down inside that, I've got the aluminum foil. And I've also got a, my little skillet there that I use for uh, heating up beef tallow and barbecue sauce and that kind of thing. So basically when I prep my meat inside, I bring it out, set it here. I turn around, I put it on the smoker and, uh, and I got all my wood handy. And then inside this drawer, I got all kinds of stuff down here. Here's all of my hooks. Sorry for the background noise. I got fans going in here today. Here's my hooks from Oklahoma Joe's Bronco if I want to hang meat. Down in here also, I've got all my knives. I've also got down in here, here's my mat that goes up under my chopping box to keep it from spinning. Here's my rack for burn ends. Slide it right back down in there. And I keep all my igniters, my scissors here for spatchcock and chicken. And it's just a good little catch-all. I can put everything down in here. <clears throat> and, uh, and it's easy to access to it when I'm out here out here uh, barbecuing. And so uh, anyway, just a little, little makeshift use of, a, of uh, something that's intended to be used for something totally different, but it's worked out perfect out here. So just wanted to show that to you today. I've had a lot of people, like I said, ask about it, and I figured I'd just showcase it and let you see it. The brand on this one is uh, Performax, P-E-R-F-O-R-M-A-X, in case you're kind of wondering. You might be able to zoom in right there, but Anyway, oh, one other thing, <coughs> on this end, it's got a basket too. I don't know if you can see that, but there's a basket right there. I've also got a basket up here into this. And in this basket right here, I keep extra probes for my, uh, for my ink bird thermometer, uh, any kind of remotes I might have for anything, but it's pretty, pretty handy right there as well. So anyway, I get done with this, I just move it to a part in the garage I normally keep it at and uh, put it over out of the way. And then when I'm ready to use it, just pull it back out. So hopefully you guys have enjoyed this little tutorial, if you will, on this. Uh, feel free to ask me any questions you may have. Uh, and I just kind of urge you, you know, next time you're at your local hardware store, just when you're looking at stuff, look at it and say, hey, what kind of alternative use can I maybe use this for uh, at my barbecue passion? So thanks for watching today. Hopefully you enjoyed the video. If you did, please like the video and subscribe to my channel, Baker's Barbecue and come back and continue to watch videos. So to the next time I see you, happy smoking.